Hi everyone, welcome to our kitchen. I'm here to show you our um, xylem lab that uses celery. Uh, celery is the genus Apium and species Graviolens, and it's a angiospermatophyta, which means um, it is a flowering plant. And but what we're gonna look at it today is because it is a vascular plant, just like all angiosperms, the celery has xylem and phloem tissue. And what we're gonna demonstrate is um, a quick and easy way for you to get a visualization of the xylem of the celery. So the first thing I'm gonna do is cut away at these stems, which are the stems that I'm not gonna use because I want to use stems with flowers, or sorry, with leaves. I'm gonna save these for maybe having ants in a log or just eating as a snack. I'm gonna get into the leaves, the stems that have some leaves on them. I want leaves because in order to show um, the xylem, I need to have some transpiration happening. And transpiration is the loss of the water through the leaves. So now I'm gonna cut the celery stalk underwater. I wanna cut it underwater so that the there's no air bubble that forms in the xylem and everything is just stays in water. So I'm gonna to try to uh, cut celery in the water. There we go. I might save this part for doing some plant repropagation experiment or something. And now I have these beautiful celery stems that have um, their leaves. And I'm gonna put them into uh, this container, which was just gonna hold them upright and Try to do that with as little water uh, loss as possible. That's probably good. There we go. And now I'm gonna add just a bit of food coloring to make the water just visual so that we can see how it moves through the celery stem. I'm sure you guys have done experiments like this maybe when you were in kindergarten or elementary school, but it's really a great way. And we're gonna check it uh, tomorrow and see how the water has moved through the plant. Hi, good morning everyone. It's been about 12 hours since we put the celery in the water and I just want to zoom in, let you see the leaves are already starting to have some pink, reddish on the tips. If I look at that stalk there, you can actually see some of the red starting to come up through the xylem of the celery. I'll let it go for another few hours today and then we're going to cut open the celery. All right, hi everyone. It's the next day. Our celery's been sitting overnight and we're going to examine it now. I'm going to take one of the stalks. You can probably see that the leaves kind of have a reddish tinge to them now. And if I break open, Oh, actually, you can hear that cellulose cell wall breaking. You can see these strings of red. Those are where the water has moved up the plant um, through the xylem. So those are the xylem strings that the water is transporting from the bottom up and out the leaves through transpiration due to the cohesion and adhesion of water. 